This is Dakota News Now Sports. In Iowa, the high school softball and baseball season is played in the summer, and July means it's playoff time. Postseason is well underway for baseball, and the road to Fort Dodge for softball begins tonight. West Lyon finished the year 20 and 3, ranked 10th in Class 3A. They're the top seed in Region 1, opening tonight with Boyd and Hull Rock Valley and Larchwood. The game's still tied in the first inning when Ella Langenhorst changes that with a blast solo shot, giving West Lyon their first lead of the game. And then the second inning, the Wildcats would start to open things up. Lang and Horse smashing one deep to left for a double this time, extending the lead for West Line to three runs. And they blow it open in the third with a 7 to 1 lead. Now it's Lang and Horse doing her second home run of the ball game. She had herself a night this evening in Largewood. And then finally, it'll be Braylon Childress adding to the home run parade. Hitting a solo shot of her own just moments after Langenhorst went deep. That made it 10 to 1 West Lion. She hit it to the playground. Final would be 11 to 1 as the Wildcats cruise into the semifinals. Now they'll face the winner of the other quarterfinal, which was in Orange City between the host MOC Floyd Valley and Spirit Lake. Spirit Lake's Faith the Wild hammering this ball over the left fielder's head. Two runs come in to score. Spirit Lake within two, down four to two. However, the home team would add to their advantage. Allison Heller laces a curve down the line. In the left field, Brooklyn Bile will head on home at 6-2. The Dutch faithful are rocking, wanting to add to that lead. However, Emma Whiting snags it and then tags the runner for the unassisted double play in the inning. Too much MOC Floyd Valley in this one, though. Eddie Lusink smacks it up the middle to play to pair. And MOC Floyd Valley wins 10-6. They'll play at West Lion Saturday at 7. They'll be at the same time as the West Lion baseball team hosting the district title game with Unity Christian.